Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can customize the S Pen Air Actions gestures on the Samsung Galaxy S24 series. First, tap on the home button to go back to the home screen. Then from the home screen, swipe down at the top, then tap on the settings icon. Now in the settings page, we then scroll down and tap on advanced features. Next, tap on S Pen, then tap on Air Actions, tap on the left hand side. Now at the top, make sure you switch on Air Actions. Then we go down. In here, there are five different gestures that you can customize. Uh, the back and forward, the up and down, and then forward and back, and then down and up. And the other one is just kind of like a shake action. Okay, so here if we pull out the S Pen and we can test it out. So to customize the back and forward action, we can tap on that. At the moment, it said that a gesture has been assigned with a back uh, navigation feature. So here you can see if I uh, swipe like this, you can see it go back to the previous screen. So I can go in here and customize it and change the function to say, uh, create a new note so you can create a new note on that so if I press and do that it will start a new note as you can see so what you want to do is press on the button and then hold your pen kind of like this to make it easy and then you can just uh, press and hold and then go like that and that will perform that action there so that is one gesture that you can assign to the next one is the up and down so you can tap on that and then you at the moment it is assigned to the home button you can assign uh, for the, that gesture to open up an app so that can open up say the YouTube app uh, pen up or my file so for example I set it to my file so if I do this kind of action up and down so I just touch the camera so I can just do up and down that will allow me to uh, open up so I go back in here open up my files so that should open up my files if I do that correctly so that's wrong so I'm just gonna make it do it slower up and down so we try it again so that's still trying to, that's still thinking that I'm going forward and back, so we want to try again. So that action kind of like hard to get, so we need to practice. So we need to lift the pen up like that and then kind of up and down to get it working. So okay, so that that gesture needs some I need some to practice some on that gesture there. So there it is, it's open up uh, my files. Okay, so our next gesture is the, the um, this one here. We go forward and then back. So we go forward and then back, and we got that. So that will open up reasons. So if we tap on that, you can customize the right and back action to say reasons or right screen. Next one is the smart select. Now on each of these uh, gestures, you can decide to turn on or turn off. So here we can choose to turn off the down and up action. If you don't use it, you can switch it off. And uh, if you use it, you can switch it on and then assign uh, a function to that gesture. And the last one is the right screen. So that kind of like a shake action. So you kind of move back and forth like this. And you can see that will allow me to uh, take a screenshot and then I can start to write on my screen. And that's it. Then we can uh, uh, share it or we can uh, save it. And I can just uh, tap on the save button to save that. And that is how you can customize your S Pen and Actions gestures. So we've got five different gestures that you can customize uh, in here. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel for more videos.